Hi, I'm Megan Monroe and I'm 27 years old and I'm a fashion designer. I'm originally from New Jersey. I went to college in Philadelphia and I moved from Philadelphia out here to California and I currently live in Pine Mountain Club. As a fashion designer, I do custom clothing, uh, specific pieces for photo shoots, special occasions, and I also offer private label for boutiques. I got started uh, in this industry kind of by surprise. I totally shocked my parents when I told them I wanted to be a designer. I had always painted and done creative things, but I never really gave any particular direction toward fashion. I was always a total tomboy, so I didn't really dress the part, but I have a crazy imagination and I always had lots of ideas of things that I thought would be interesting to showcase as fashion uh, versus just a piece of art. I think I officially developed my style when I was in college. I went to Philadelphia University and I was in a very technical program where I had to have absolutely perfect seams and stitches and basically make zero mistakes for all the technical pattern making uh, aspects of design. And I, since I'm very creative, I kind of always tried to push the envelope and go outside of that and try and understand why everything had to be perfect because I really enjoy asymmetry and non-traditional things. I would say that my personal style is a little bit more out of the box thinking, um, not your everyday streetwear, um, something with a little bit of a futuristic twist and a lot of uh, vintage inspiration. The reason why I enjoy doing custom clothing the most is because someone that has a vision will explain it to me and then I can actually make it a reality, but I do it with my own personal twist on it. So I sort of bring out the creativity in the wear that they may not think that they actually have themselves. These two dresses over here um, are actually for a sort of fun project that I'm doing with another designer and a photographer. And basically I found her on Instagram and I really liked her independent work that she was doing and she always seems to have really positive vibes. So I sent her a message and I asked if she wanted to do a space themed photo shoot with me. And it's totally just kind of a fun thing that we're hoping will evolve into something else. Ultimately, my journey in the fashion industry will hopefully lead me to having an awesome fashion house, kind of the old school style that you would have seen back in the day with some of the most well-known designers that we appreciate now, where it would be extremely one-on-one -on -one with uh, custom clients, and also I would be churning out some avant-garde couture pieces for the runway, or do a full line for a movie or some type of in important set in the industry. I think when it comes to being inspired, it's also important to surround yourself by people that are also inspiring to you and that give you positive aspirations and that can always influence you in a positive way so that you're not being distracted by any type of negative energy or letting any, anyone tell you that you can't do what you wanna do. I think that you should always do what makes you happy and commit to your passion with every ounce of your being, even when you feel like you're not gonna make it, just push a little bit harder and you'll get there.